Hello people of the internet, my name is George, the artist here at Leafy Games. And I'm Preston, the programmer. And we have a couple new things to show you. We have a new update that is uh, released, uh, should be released by the time this video is out, which adds a few new features and a little bit uh, something else. So first I'll go over something. Uh, if you uh, want to customize your controls, either for like, uh, if you have a joystick that uh, you want to add support for, um, we made, we've added some tools to the control screen to help make customizing your controls a little bit easier. Um, you can't do it in game, but it allows uh, you to like dynamically reload the file. That's what refresh file does. You can change between multiple different bindings files and a few other things. So for people that really like to customize their controls or just have very unique setups, uh, this should help them uh, just make it a little bit easier. So. Yeah, and uh, just to reiterate, in the future, by the time we release this game, you will be able to customize these key bindings in-game. It's just a very early version of that. Correct, correct. You will be able to do it in the game. Um, and then I'm going to pass it off to George, who's going to show you uh, the new content. Alright, um, so yeah, if you uh, play the game often, you'll probably notice that there's these um, menus have been a little uh, been tweaked. They look a little nicer overall, and it's just uh, you know quite pleasant. And um, also, you'll notice that this is pretty new: ship selection. And that is because we decided it was about time to add a new ship. So the WD Cruiser is now playable. It is uh, it's early, but um, yeah, you can walk around on the ship. You can fight it, and it should work relatively well compared to the Intrepid. So uh, we're pretty excited to get that in the game and to have you guys. Um, you know, play around with it. I'll just show off the bridge real quick, um, and I'll leave the rest. There's, there's quite a large interior layout, and it's exciting because it's very different from the uh, Intrepid. So it's, it's nice to, you know, uh, get some variation in the game. But I'll just, I'll actually, I won't go exploring this video. I'll just let the people, who, I'll just let you guys explore it yourselves, and um, yeah, let us know what you think. Um, here's the uh, exterior. You can see. Uh, um, we went over the cruiser quite a while back in like devlog 2 or 3 um, and we've done a, a lot of uh, redesigns and uh, iterations on the uh, you know the exterior and the interior so uh, we're excited to hear uh, what you guys think um, so that will be it for now uh, we're uh, going con we're continuing to work on the next major class update this is not a major update it's just a smaller one focused on uh, bug fixes, tweaks, and uh, new, some, some new content. Yeah, for people dealing with a few of the bugs, for example, swapping ship components, that uh, should be fixed this patch. So, um, yep, yeah. and by the time this video is uploaded, uh, it's already out on Steam and Humble. So if you, uh, if you have the alpha access, feel free to download it and check it out. And please let us know what you think on our forums or email. Have a good one, guys.